Welcome to my custom interloper run. I'm Nefo29, and here's what's in our backpack. We're a little overweight, but we have a whole bunch of food. That's why. Uh, we're one bandage down. Clothing can do with some repairs. There's all that meat. I grabbed the meat that was on the stove overnight. I grabbed two pots as well. And there we go. We are day 58, and here's our skills. Fire starting's almost at four. There we go, and we're very early morning. So we have to go do that. And I'm gonna throw another chunk of the reclaimed wood. You're one full kilogram. What are you? You're 0.25. Alright. Let's see if we can make some rabbit pie. Take you, and I believe it's just you, right? Rabbit pie. Okay, I'm going to shut the lantern off. Uh, where is it? Right there. 56 minutes. 45 till ready. Um, let's just do that. And let's do that. What do we got? We got 44 minutes we need, and we got 45 there. 21 till ready. Can I repair at least my toque in that time? We can. All right, you're finished. 18, 16. All right, you will not overcook, so that's fine. Let's repair these. So time to hunt another region for a battery. Basin to Forlorn to Broken Railroad. We'll see. Uh, I'm gonna drop the ingredients. Cooking oil, you go right there. You go right there. Water, we have eight. I'll keep like four, I guess. 429, that works, right? Uh, the weather does not sound good. Oh, I wanted to get rid of some of these flare shells. We don't need that many. Um, oh, you're not there, that's why. Okay, 15. We only need like, I don't know. Oops do that. Uh, your arrows. We're gonna have one break. So you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna take one of those. I'm gonna take three of those. Um, I'm gonna drop this wood. Uh, we need to collect more sticks as well. Well, let's finish researching this. Alright, that's done, and actually that worked out nice. Um... I'm gonna save those pies. We don't need to use them just yet. that actually I wanted to do this and what else is there well you can go down over here and 
Do I have more books? I do have more books. Or do I have books I want? Zero out of four. Zero out of four. Hmm. Hmm, what to do, what to do? Okay, let's go. So we have bear meat that we can drop right here. Thirty-eight. Oh boy. If we're going to get a battery... We're gonna have to go light. Because... I don't remember... Exact... The goat. So I'm going to take a can. Uh, we need to be down to at least 35. Throw those in there. Um, they don't weigh much, but... They weigh enough. I'm going to throw you in there too. And we should lose. Yeah, we're at 3542. So. Yeah. Is that the, is that the quickest way to broken railroad? Go down to the basin. sucks the problem is I don't really know that route oh there's more saplings whatever well we'll get it figured out Let's, yeah, let's just, I guess let's just go this way. There's another sapling. It's a nice day. Minus two. I guess we're going to find out if there's a moose down here. If there's a moose down here, I don't know that I want to be hunting it because I want to get this battery. If you know what I'm saying, can we see down there? It's a matter of whether it would actually render in as well. I'm not sure that this is necessarily a quicker way. Just because, I mean, the other way we just go to Mystery Lake, uh, cut through Forlorn and we're there. But we'll see. I gotta get used to going through here anyways, right? So why not? Uh, mind you, I will be cutting through here. I will not be meandering about. I think we'll check the locations in here, but in terms of a long-term stay or, or even a few days, I'm 
pretty much just wanted to get right through here. I didn't hear a moose yet. I have two sticks, okay. This bypasses Mystery Lake and drops you into Forlorn closer to Broken Railroad if memory serves correctly. Those crows you hear, that's for one of my bodies <laughs> when I fell. <laughs> Uh, I should have went that way, actually, shouldn't I? Do you see what I see? Yeah, we got moose markings. Are we gonna have any birch? Oh, we are. So you, you probably saw on Discord, I think I got that sound fixed. It's, it doesn't sound like, like it, it doesn't seem like it. But I was listening yesterday. I got the sound to happen yesterday on my computer. Which really does sound like the fan. Like one of the fans might be messed up, right? You saw it when I was walking down the hill? Nice. And so anyways, I thought, okay, well, be before, because I had to switch the RAM and I was listening real close and I thought, man, that sound sounds like it's coming right from where the ram is. So I took the case, laid it flat, took off the front, and no moose. Luckily, no moose. Um, I pushed down on the ram and one of them clicked and I thought, oh no. I swear they both clicked when I put them in. So I tried it again. I even played Seven Days to Die for a few hours with OG and uh, it was annoying when I was playing that game the previous day and the the sound wasn't there. So I'm wondering, maybe it's not actually a fan. Maybe it's just one of those clips that holds the RAM in was, was vibrating. That's why you always look at something. Because, <laughs> man, if I would have took it in, which this place is not close. It's like on the other side of the city. It's like an hour drive. And if they would have been like, yeah, your RAM wasn't clicked in. That's all it was. I would have felt like such an idiot. Is this uh, still a thing? Yep. It certainly is. <laughs> well, uh-oh, we have a fire striker. Get your guesses in. Merge says 77. I'm going to chill out right here. I'm going to eat. Look at all of that coffee. And I'm going to drink. And XM says 82. I'm gonna say 75. I'm gonna say 96, whatever. Yeah, 96. I think I can use 54. <laughs> huh? Ain't none of us close. The magic coal. We'll head straight over there and get that done and we'll be on our way. Um, I have two of those. Okay, good.
Hey, Cherry Lamb, welcome in. And XM, thank you for the resub. Five months. Thank you. Time flies, eh? Are there no wolves down here? Nothing there. Some reclaimed wood. Oh, have one bandage, please. Ah, why? All right, what's in here? Looks like oh. this has been here a while. Should I? Uh, I'm debate. Uh, you yeah, know what? Let's just go. What's our weight? 39. I was debating on just leaving all the wood here. You know what? I'm going to do that. I'm going to do that. Because there will be a point where we have to actually come down here and hang out a little bit when we go after the moose. And we're going to need wood. And we're going to need coal. We'll drop three. We'll prepare ahead. You're planning on making several fishing tip ups and fishing down here. Uh, I don't know. And I don't, I'd rather just fish in a hut. It's. I don't know. I don't know how I feel about the tip-ups not working towards your skill. Well, I guess let's go, bud. There we go. That's why we brought the arrow shaft. XM likes it down here. It's not a bad area. It's kind of like its own little region. It's, in my opinion, this is kind of what a transition zone should be. An area you can just go hang out in and, uh, you know, survive without bringing everything to survive. Like the requirements of food and such should all be down. Oh, wow. XM is on fire. Thank you for the gift sub. Gonna have a moose up here too. Uh, what is it? It's noon. I don't see any markings, but I'm prone to missing them anyway, so. Let's just take it. We'll take you and relocate you somewhere. This stuff will come in handy. This can be another spare set. Uh, what did we have for birch bark? We had three. Well, you can usually find a few in here. It's only midday, so we I think we do have enough time to kind of do this.
We're gonna have so much birch bark. Provided we don't end our lives out here. Don't want to be too cocky, right? Always have to account for the chance that you may not make it. Not a lot of bark. I think there's little areas that in this that that are prone to having more. Like by this hill, maybe. I don't know. I just remember I usually find a fair amount. Not birch forest amount, but... There we go. We got a few. What are we at now? We're at eight. Let's call it good and go. Hey, little bunny. Today's word of the day is brought to you by Murdback. Today's word of the day is apodiopsis, which means the act of mentally undressing someone. Wow. I saw it. This is showing my honesty here. I could have just walked right by that. I saw it. You know, as much as I hate having an odd number, I, I have to go get it if I see it. I'll walk past 15 of them if I didn't see them, but... If I see it, gotta take it. I didn't notice. Is there a rope already there? XM's purring. <laughs> Chickens. Not gonna shoot you. Oh, well, you're a sitting duck. Look at you. Just hanging out there all like, look at me, I'm proud. I'm not going to the cave. I'm going this way. I'm just going to go down this way. Oh, we have a carcass. We didn't do this, did we? Oh, great. I, I just wasn't sure if there's a rope over there or if I actually have to bring one. I think there might be one. I hope there was only the one wolf. This is Hat Creek. One of the few named locations that I know of. By memory. Can you wear cute short shorts in this game? You could, I guess. But you'd be primarily naked. It would be technically classified as being naked. way I got my eyes peeled looking for wolves looking for a bear because we do have a bar of scent so I mean it's possible we could bring something towards us and we're gaining temperature now look at that Is that a wolf over there? I don't know. It's 
still far away if it is. Oh, that is not a wolf. That is not a wolf right there. If I can get to the hunting blind. Why do I feel like I'm going to go for a dip? This is, this is not good. It's like right there, but you know, that's just too easy. So they're going to make us go the long way around. Oh my, look at that. You can't not take these. Gots to take those. Well, I was hoping to hit that blind. I don't really want to shoot the bear, but I also think, you know my thinking, right? My thinking is if I can get a hit on him before he knows of our presence, he will most likely run. And, and there's, I also believe that there's a good chance that he'll go down. But. I just, I don't want to. Especially when he's going sideways. But I do want to go into that blind, but I don't know what's going to happen. Oh my, look at all those. We got ourselves some sexy saplings. And one more. Yay. Five. Four. <laughs> Wait. Didn't I already pick one up? Yes, I did somewhere. So we have five. I'm not a complete moron. Is that another one? I think that's a sapling. Hello, little sexy sapling. Well, there we go. Collect shrooms. Why? I got two cups. I already got two cups. Somebody was saying that they swear you get better warmth out of the mushroom tea. Like it fills your, your temperature buff. You love mushrooms and bacon for breakfast. Ugh. Why would you ruin bacon by putting mushrooms with it? Yes, mushrooms are evil. I think it's weird that humans will knowingly eat fungus. Mushrooms enhance the bacon. You can't enhance the bacon. Putting it in your mouth enhances it. 
<laughs> they need to create a bacon burger. Now hear me out. I'm trying to think of how this would work. They need to create a bacon burger that the patty itself Ooh. is bacon. That's what needs to happen. Maybe they'll put a couple strips of beef on top of it. That's that needs to be a thing. How the heck do we discover cheese? Yeah, cheese is kind of sketchy. <laughs> Oh, shish. Oh, that's not going to happen. Wow, that was quick. We're all good. Wow. I just... I didn't have enough time to pull out the bow and draw. Uh, 84. All right, we're, we're still pretty good. Oh, boy. Jesus. Wow. I think I scared the hell out of me. Can you not keep running around over here? Because, oh, I've already been here. That's the saddest part of this whole thing. I didn't even need to come in here. Yeah, cheese is sketchy. I, I I don't know what type of cheese it was, but they said that there's a there's one type of cheese that has like mites in it. And the mites are what gives it its flavor. Like why? Why? World's most expensive cheese has maggots in it. Uh. And the funny thing is, I bet most of this type of food that, that is like that I bet you most of that came from the poor who didn't have a choice, right? Like, ah, it's food. I don't care. There's maggots in it. I gotta eat it or I will die. And then the rich end up finding out about certain things and taking it over. Like same with caviar. Who thinks that that would be good? Yeah. There's some foods out there that are just like weird. Alright, is it gonna be... I think we'll make it there before. Now, did we actually even find... Yes, we did find a battery in here, didn't we? We do have a battery in here. If I remember correctly. I mean, there's almost always a battery in the maintenance yard. <laughs> what? I'm not reading that, Murd, but... What? Don't say that. How is it possible? Ah, what are you giving me mittens for? I need to focus right here. 
Hey, right. it didn't happen. Doesn't mean it still can't. I think some of those foods were also found out, dis discovered through a dare. That coffee one sounds like uh, somebody might have been like, hey. <laughs> Although maybe if you're like desperate for coffee and you happen to find it in that way, you'd be like, well, Better than no coffee. There's gonna be any wolves. Might be some feathers along the way. Gotta pull these out. I don't like the ground right here. I'm tempting fate by not going directly inside okay. because yeah, let's just go right inside here. <laughs> You're empty. We got a whole bunch of sticks. Got a lot of lantern fuel. Uh, we have eight sticks. I don't know that we can take eight sticks. Do that. Take one. I like how that says five out of four. All right. Now, did we even have a battery out here? We did. Got a battery. It's getting kind of heavy. Actually, I have an idea. There we go. <laughs> Sorry. I need a screenshot. The battery is the prime focus of this, uh, this episode. What is it? Uh, well, we can harvest you. Um, let's go see if, do I have a red toolkit here? Stuck on the wood. I don't think I do. Well. Right, let's eat up and drink up. And... I think, I think we got enough time to make an arrow. At least it gives us something to do while we're waiting here. I'd prefer that we had a red toolkit, but... All right. Now we get ourselves to the bed. Via this route. second what's in there okay oh I gotta drop that uh, snare as well I don't want to be lugging that thing around um, eat that we got a little bit of it All right. that is a spare we don't need you. I'm going to drop the extra clothing outside. Let's see if we can repair this. I 
There we go. We got it. Do you hear what I hear? Oh, come on. There we go. New buffer memory. Play that funky music. It is so beautiful when we finally get light. I'm not going to lie. You know what? It must be hard for the hinterland group because, you know, you, you see all these interiors that have lights and to know how, how amazing they can look when they are all lit up at nighttime, but also know that in your game, that's not actually going to happen. <laughs> it must actually be. It, 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 I wonder if that's like one of those things about their game that they kind of like, ah, I wish we just had light. All right, let's go to bed. I think we might wake up not fully rested. Yeah, that's right. So let's fully rest ourselves. There we go. And we are at 50. We have Two kilograms too many. We can take a rope. Not sure I can carry much more. Oh, we're not leaving anywhere. Right, you're gonna go down there. Um, we'll throw you somewhere else, I guess. What do we have? Birch bark. Craft that all up. So our maximum capacity is 48 because of that pie. And you know I'm not leaving any of this coffee or tea here. What is our food and drink? Oh, hey, look at you. We can get rid of you that way. Um, I'm going to eat. Eh, what the hell? Let's just eat the whole thing. I got to save room for one of these. I'm going to drink too because, I mean, we have a blizzard. Hey, puppy chat, welcome in. How are you doing? Uh, oh, right, I have to drop that. We don't snare rabbits. You can go up there. Uh, you're 71, 78, 85. Thanks for the shout out. Puppy Chat's a friend of OG's. OG's probably sleeping. <laughs> oh, damn. I didn't even notice. I still have all those saplings. Get out of my pocket. Um, hmm. Is there by chance anything in here? No. We're down to 47, so we're good. Weight-wise, we are good. Uh, 
Where am I? Clothing, there it is. I think we're gonna need some cloth, so. You've watched OG play this a few times? Nice. This is the survival. Alright, what do we have? We have four and we have three, uh, sorry, four leather as well. Uh, you're at 82. There we go. Now you're not. Now you're at 100. Uh, everything else is above 90. Now it's just a matter of wait until this blizzard is over. Where's our hatch? It's still at 100. Yeah. Uh, maybe if we sleep an hour, we'll wake up and it'll be a bright, sunny day. Actually wasn't expecting that to be actually a thing. <laughs> it happened. All right, we got enough room for the for the pie. We have another can. At this point, I'm not caring about the can. You howl away over there. I'm not going after you. Cause we're just leaving. I love pie. seem to be coming our way. Let's just keep going. I'll save the pie for when we actually need to eat it. shouldn't get attacked by a wolf up here because we already had a little skirmish with him, right? We should have clear passage. I'm going to keep the bow out just in case, just because the last time, I mean, we had enough time to pull the bow out. We didn't have enough time to draw the bow. And... If you can't draw it, you may as well not even have it. You walk with the bow out in this area as well, Murd? Nice. So here's my question. Now, do we, should we go back the exact same way that we came? Do you think that rope climb would absolutely obliterate us? I don't think we're safe at this point. Or do we go Mystery Lake and uh, cut through the cave and then take the, the down rope? Well, we, we never take the down rope, but then take the up rope. I think that's a shorter up rope. What the hell? Let's go through the basin. Let's go through the basin. 
Reason being, I don't use the basin nearly enough. talking about the rope isn't there until you deploy it what are you talking about which rope do you have to take the cave in forlorn why are we talking about the same spot I'm talking about just going back to, uh, you know, go, go through forlorn to where we came in. Climbing that rope we climbed down. In the basin. Are you confused as well? <laughs> oh, Murd wants a stretch. Can I pull off a stretch? There we go. Are you thinking the rope in Forlorn where the moose is? that goes down that I was questioning earlier like is there a rope there or is there not because that's not the rope I, I don't go up Man, that way heavy. I'm gonna go this way and hope that that bear is not there um, I'm gonna eat you a little bit I'm gonna drink you a little bit and I'm gonna pull you out. There's the bear. You kidding me? There's a bear like right there, dummy. No bear extermination, we're just carrying on. Oh, that that's the rope you're talking about. Yeah, I don't I don't you almost ever use that rope. You can get up the other way. Without uh taking the rope area it's minus four it's not that bad that wolf was still tracking us I want to go there but I think it's risky Because I don't, number one, I don't know if there's anything at that hunting blind that's worth risking our life for. And all that bear has to do is turn around. And by the time we're there, he's like there. Yeah, we go up to Hat Creek. There's a way of uh, skirting your way up. You, um, you can also, there's that little cave up there too that takes you around. That 
wolf wants your bacon. We have sausage pants. We call this we call the snow pants sausage pants. Because whenever I get attacked when I'm wearing them, they get eaten. Hat Creek. Yeah, I've lost so many pairs. Snow pants and toques. It's a toss up as to which one I've lost more of. Now, I haven't gone up this way for a while. I may not remember how to do it. But I'm going to try it. I'm pretty sure I'll get it. I mean, I, I don't think it was, wasn't terribly difficult. You just kind of have to know. Didn't know you could shimmy up around here. I think we got to start at that side. Like I said, it's been a while since I've done it, but... Um, there we go. It's that easy. That's not even a hard one. Murd learned something today. Nice. I am proud to say that I didn't even learn that from anybody. I just thought, well, ah, what the hell? I'll try and see if I can get up there. And I did. Now, where am I going? Am I going the right way? This doesn't feel right. Somehow I think it should be, you know what, put you away. This doesn't feel right either. None of this feels right. What the heck? Where am I? Isn't there, isn't this supposed to be a nice, easy path? Well, let's go around that. Well, let's, I, I don't know. You'd get lost. This just doesn't feel like it's the way. But maybe it is. It's not. Well, where am I? How do I get to the upper? <laughs> yep. Nafo is lost. Is this not the one that I was supposed to go up? This is where we go. Or is it up there? That might not even be the right spot. Uh, what was sprained? My wrist. All right, I'm I'm okay with that. Knifeo lost is like the clouds being in the sky, pretty much. I think yeah, that's that's the, not the right spot. It's up on the upper. That's why. Now I wonder if I'm going to get a sprain doing this. Oh, 
So far, no spraying. That's actually quite surprising. No englastrid. There it is. Right, right there. That is the spot. You can see why I was confused because it's a similar looking spot. And like I said, I haven't, I haven't gone this way for so long. We may as well take those. Something tells me that these feathers are not going to put us over. All right, there she be. Oh, we didn't even trigger the waterfall when we were here. All right, let's see if I can remember. There we go. This looks more familiar. Hey, OG. Welcome in. How you doing? Yeah, we have a battery. Right there. All the way from the maintenance yard. In Broken Railroad. Railroad. I can't speak. What's the time? Ooh. Go this way. What do you need it for? It goes in the tower. It's supposed to be one up there, but there wasn't. Maybe it was that food gate. <laughs> That's not good. I wonder if I can drop any of this gear. OG's on a 15 stream streak. Nice. Thank you, OG. What's our weight at right now? 46. Okay, let's... We're gonna drink a coffee. Actually, I don't know if I'm gonna drink a coffee. What's... We're still at 45 there, so that's fine. And we do have a lot of alertness, so I think the, the climb, I think we can make it. Although it's two climbs. Two hefty climbs with a battery. Should do a run where it's guns only, no bows. Any animals we kill, we just leave the the, the feathers behind. And then one day it'll just be nothing but feathers all over the ground. Alright. This is another area I don't really do as much as I probably 
should, which is coming into the basin. So finding the rope, I know the rope's off to the left. One of them anyways. But I can get myself lost here. You know it. I know it. Is there a piece of birch bark? I have one extra piece, right? Yeah. Maybe. I was actually kind of wondering because we had a blizzard if, if maybe a moose might appear up here. A birch bark is all I want, and a rope. Well, maybe not. Let's go this way, I guess. the rope up here there it is okay I'm good I'm good you're good we're good although it's kind of a troll on how you get up here how do you get up there? Oh, I missed it. It's over here. They're going to make us break our ankle before we get there. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, I totally missed the path up. I thought I was on the path. of coffee and I have one cup I think we drink the coffee first on the first rope we drink that that'll turn that one white yeah and let's go Eat a peach pie. No, never. Never again will I ever eat a peach pie in this game. All right. And now that one. And I guess in the morning we'll uh, we'll go and fix the tower. Look at us, we're gaining temperature all on this climb. You know I should have stopped at that ledge. You know I should have. But I didn't. I'm probably going to regret it. It's going to be close. Uh-oh. <laughs> you trolling me with the peach pie sucked. <laughs> I needed a full night's rest and I got like about a half hour. <laughs> oh, come on. Pull yourself up, Astrid. You can do it. There we go. 
Yeah, only posers stop at the ledge. Come on. Eat that. Good job, Astrid. I remember the, when the mementos first came out, I was over here scouring this area. <laughs> I didn't know what like the difference between memento cache and memento hint was. So I was scouring these rocks, swearing left and right about how stupid this game is and this and that. <laughs> and then eventually I found out that, oh yeah, the hint is just showing you something. It's just showing you the rope that's there. Hey, dear. <laughs> uh, glad you found that one funny. Never again will I create peach pie. I will eat canned peaches. But I will not eat the pie. Alright, I'm wondering... Should we just go right to Grey Mother's? Because obviously, as soon as we repair that tower, we're gone. We're out of here. Eh, let's spend the night here, I guess. What is the time? It's almost nighttime. I don't know, man. I think I'm just going to grab some food and go. I'm not sure I can carry much more. Let's go. We'll be closer to the tower when we wake up. Hey, Darth. Welcome in. I didn't miss you today. <laughs> How are you doing, Darth? Oh, you know what? to stay here you know why I have one bow that's at 50% and when they're at 50% I would prefer to have two anything I can drop uh, probably the feathers I can leave those um, okay instantly I feel better do that that doesn't look very good. And yeah. So, oh. what are all of these fire strikers at? 60, 60, 60s, 50s. Let's do that. We have 119. Seem to have some water over here. Oh, you know what would have sucked? <laughs> that that would have sucked a lot. Leaving without having 
my pots. All right, let's go. I think, well, you know what? I think we might be getting an Aurora tonight. Aurora. Oh, damn. Oh, gee, Mert's gonna hate you because he's gonna be like, damn it. You want to? I, I totally forgot about that. Let's just put you right there. <laughs> wow. You know, I, I remember where I picked that up, too. I remember that bef we picked that up before we got to the maintenance yard. I should have been leaving it at the maintenance yard. That was right there, a kilogram I didn't need to be carrying. Oh, man. Unbelievable. What's the other one? Sorry, I was sneezing. Way. Yeah, we're obviously we're gonna spend the night in Grey Mothers. I'm I'm still leaving this open as to whether we're gonna move from there uh, back to Grey Mothers, or maybe even like the the credit union or the bank or something like that. That way I'm st I'm not still in Grey Mothers. But I'm I'm just finding like that's you know, it's it's too far out of the way. And that's no fun for nobody. I mean, I tried it. But it's too far. It's too much too much dead walking. Really. That's a place you go to and then you're done. And maybe if you're exiting through that area, that's fine, right? But I think to make that your base is not a wise decision. So in the future, we might move. We have a sled, so that'll make it a little easier. And it's probably best to do it Sooner rather than later, because the longer we stay there, the more stuff we will accumulate. Yeah, yeah, you got me on that one. Yeah. I am definitely 100% saying it's a nice place to visit, but I don't want to live there. <laughs> you know how angry I'll be if I go into Grey Mothers and we find a battery in there? 
Just chilling out in the corner. Look at it. Home sweet home. Uh, you, I don't think I would stay there. I think if, if we took on a different base, I mean, we would still be going there for the cooking anyways. I mean, you're kind of limited to, I mean, when you got six burners, why would you honestly be staying in another house? It just doesn't make sense. All right, we can probably put you away at this point. Oh, it's getting dark out here. Um, Shelter. just to get you out of my pocket, let's throw you on the floor. Honey, I'm home. Ah. Look at it. Look at it. It's so nice. empty uh well i guess we may as well just go right to bed we're tired it's my bed actually it might be her bed might be oh dang this will come in handy that will just go downstairs i think put you right there because we cannot miss you now, what else did I miss in this place all right let's just drink up and go to bed And there we go. Take a sip. And we will eat. And I didn't notice the time. Not quite. You know what? Let's not do that. Let's, uh, take the cloth. <clears throat> that one doesn't have on this side. I must have taken that one before. Okay, there's some. Yeah, you gotta change the random batteries found from four to three, but put an asterisk there. Cause I think they just didn't put the battery here. I think it was supposed to be here. Or I, I will stand by the fact that maybe I just missed it. Maybe they hit it a little bit too well. Oh wow, I can't see at all. There's no cloth. There's that G button again. I really got to swap my G and my H, but honestly, if I do it, I will be so messed up because I'm so used to it being H that I would mess up. There we go. We can see. And oh, there's none up there. I think the weather's still bad, so we're just going to continue. Uh, 
do that because we're thirsty. Still sounds bad out there. I think now it's cleared up. Yeah, it sounds quiet. Wow. We're going to take six. Uh, we only have two bandages, so we're going to make one right now so we don't forget because we have a tendency to forget. And clothing is primarily good. Uh, those crackers can stay here. I'm not a fan of dragging crackers around. And... There you go. Fill the belly. And we'll drink you. I'm gonna leave the meat here on the on the front step oh xm wants coffee time okay give me a second oh i did it those dang pies all right i'm gonna leave the meat there and apparently all those pies so we can walk a little bit faster here we go. There was a feather. Thanks, XM. Now I have to look. Okay, I do have the battery. Ah, the pies. Every time, man, every single time I have the pies, I do that. That's a me thing, too. That's not even on Hinterland. There's a stack of three. You can't drop a stack. It will drop individually. Was that loud enough? I wasn't sure because with my microphone being in a different position, I hope it was. If you feel ripped off, I'll do it again, and I'll do it better this time. Radio power. You know my stuff? It can't blizzard again. It just did. Didn't it? It was perfect. Oh, nice. Peach pie redeem. Never. You will never see a peach pie redeem. Maybe that other one wasn't actually a blizzard. Maybe it was just windy. going to make a peach pie right now. You need to make a cherry pie. Not a peach pie. Because your name is Cherry cherry Lum, not Peach Lum. Alright, we're going to HRV. Slam it shut. Let's go. Off to HRV and it is not even noon.
You'll change your name for Peaches. <laughs> Yeah, pies are different where Murd is. They're not like delicious desserts. They're like meat pies. We have meat pies here though. But we don't really associate meat with a pie. You have to say it like that. You have to say pie. It's like Cartman. <laughs> All right, I don't know if I should wait a little longer. I'm going to wait a little longer because I don't trust the weather. And I mean, I guess we need to warm up. Is there any more cloth in there? Where's that light coming from? Must be the sun coming in and hitting right there. Must be. I'm going to do that. I'm going to take six. Um, I'm trying to kill some time while, while our temperature goes back all the way up. Um, oh, you know what? I don't have. I left some stuff in that box. Is there spray paint in here? Anywhere. All right, maybe downstairs. Maybe. Because if we're in HRV and we're doing like full, a full search of uh, HRV, I need paint. Because I will never remember that. All right, if there was paint in here, I would have obviously put it on the table. Make sure I didn't miss any of these. Uh, well, credit unions probably got some. Go check in here. Alright. Double checking while I'm looking for more paint. All right, maybe it was the bank or not the bank, whatever that is. The other place. Is this the saddest town ever? Maybe. We will check in the post office. I know we found multiple cans of paint out here i just don't know exactly which building it was uh well maybe the church no the church wouldn't have it because when i was there i needed paint and i didn't have paint whatever i guess we're going Yeah, we're going. That guy did. That guy died checking his mail. Yeah, you saw the bills.
Alright. Uh, I would love some paint. I only have 12 arrows too. That's not a lot of arrows. HRV with 12 arrows. And no flares. But we can do it. I hope. I hope. If I don't do it, I'm going to be accused of go, 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 go. <laughs> And it won't be a wrong accusation. Because really, I should I should really have spent a little bit more time checking through that box to see if there was anything I really, really, really wanted. But it's okay. Maybe even some lantern fuel would have been a smart idea. time almost midday there was any paint in the trailer the reason the reason I'm if you don't know the reason I, I want paint so badly is because when I find mementos I like to use the paint to mark it off that I've got that one um, I can't really show you here because I don't have any but Did we not get any? Or these are all hints. Pleasant Valley I made of. Hey. There we go. There's one that's marked off. That's what I like to do. Just go to the church and pray for it. <laughs> I don't think it works that way. So yeah, if I if I don't mark the mementos as I take them, I am likely to go and try to look for them again and just waste everybody's time. And I don't want to do that. So we'll go over here and check this out. Paint is a lot of times found in the trailers. A lot of time it's found in the trailers. Usually in the exact same spot in the trailers too. <laughs> Behind the uh, the cabinet on the far side. Let's see. Oh no. I don't see any. Oh no. Well, I guess. Nope. Oh, dude. Get out of there. Aha. <laughs> I got paint. Now I am a happy person. Lucky. That's one of the few times that paint isn't in the same spot. Only because this has got lockers in it. But I'm so happy. 
I used to hate paint. I used to think it was like the biggest waste in the game and then I found my own personal use for it. Now I don't hate it anymore. Kind of like it. Uh, I don't even know what I have for wood fires. I have five, four, and three. All right. Should grab more sticks. Um. Hmm. I'm not going straight for the bunker, but well, the the normal bunker. I'm not going straight for the normal bunker. Um, I'm gonna go to my cave. HRV is a place where I don't know that I'm gonna actually use a new place as my base, uh, just because. That cave I use is fairly close to the entrance and everything else is kind of far, honestly. Uh, e even the bunker, I mean. Take your pick on which bunker. One of them is just flat out, no, the, like it sucks. And the signal void bunker is just too far. And we're not in the business of trying to make our game even more difficult in that fashion. It was more so just to see like different views of 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 areas right places we haven't necessarily been in for any amount of time that looks like a face that looks like a rabbit hat there's his one shoulder there's his other shoulder <laughs> am i seeing things <laughs> All right, now I'm forgetting where I was. Oh boy. Now let's get out of here. Welcome to HRV. Mert keeps meaning to take a spray paint with you when you're traveling to the cave. From the airfield to zona, can zona contamination to Sundered Pass, to mark the trail through it. It's a good idea, that's a nasty cave. Good old Peridolia? What is that word? I've never seen that word. I don't know what that word is. That's almost a word of the day right there. That's a twofer. The tendency to find patterns or shapes in random objects. Oh, okay. Neat. Am I just hearing water? Yeah, I think I'm just hearing water.
Do you use that word all the time? Nope, I don't think I've ever heard it. Alright, that's where we're headed, right there. But... We are gonna go to our cave first, because we still got a lot of time before the Aurora kicks in. And... Oh, I can't crouch. <laughs> I just wanna crouch and shoot you. There you go. Are you kidding me? <laughs> oh my. Oh man. Well, maybe you'll run at us and I can have another. That's the, when they bounce like while they're running like that. It's it's pretty easy to. I'm well. You think you have an easy headshot? Oh, come on. You think you have an easy headshot, but you shoot at that split second where nope. And your arrow goes like right over top of them. Oh my. There we go. There we go. All right, we need a fire. 95, that'll work. Darth saw a duck in the clouds yesterday. Nice. Come on, little fire. Oh, why did I use that? I shouldn't have used that. You know why? Well, we got enough sticks that I can get some warmth. There we go. Um, we do have birch bark tea. Okay. I'm just going to take all eight. Oh, I don't want 8.3. I want eight. Give me eight. Oh my. What's wrong with me? Let's take four. <laughs> if, if you don't want the, the point three, like I don't want the point three. I want the carcass to stay here. And if you don't want it, you can't just go back because it'll then subtract everything. Like, watch. Like, if you do that now, it's like 3.8. 3.3. So you can't do it. You can't just minus it that way. You have to actually exit out each time. Yeah, we'll take four and we'll take four and we'll call that eight. And we'll do that. How long we got an hour twenty six? Um actually Did I have any that I'd started? That's the one I want right there. Jesus, Darth. Get the hell out of me. I was scratching my back when you did that. <laughs> and and I'm not even lying, like my arm shook. My back scratching arm. I oh damn it.
159 whatever i'm gonna drink the water we have because we're gonna find a bunch of water in the signal void bunker and we're not gonna bother cooking you guys thank you let's go we gotta hurry now because we gotta get to our cave drop it off and then we gotta get back to the uh the signal void cave and we also got to be careful you still can't hear the wolf sounds there must be a setting on your PC that you like in your in your twitch settings That was murdered. I heard it. kind of wondering what that was sometimes the bears will sleep in weird spots right and I was worried that maybe that was the bear sleeping there all right come on Astrid hurry up hurry up hurry up hurry up let's do that I'm taking the cooked meat Taking this. Uh, I think we got it all. And let's go. Um, all right. That is highly not going to happen. I want to do this. Just because if it's neatly organized, I can tell if the wolves have come over and taken any of it I do think that that is a thing based on what I've personally seen happen in the game you just went that way there's a sapling right there. There he is. Oh, he saw me. Oh, that wasn't... I was trying to pick the sapling. Oh, shish. I'm in trouble. I meant to take the sapling, not actually draw on him. I need to find a place to rest. And the terrain, I'm not happy with the terrain. I think it's, yeah, let's go, bud. There we go. Oh, did I forget that? Oh. What an idiot. I have the hide and the guts. No wonder. No wonder. And yes, I did fully intend to drop the hide and guts in the cave. Oh, well. That's a big, fat, juicy buck over there. Is it? Or is it just a bunny next to some cattails? 
I'm looking at that and I thought it was a big juicy buck behind a hill. And now I'm thinking, nope, that is not what that is. But we could have a bear come from that direction. So I want to play it safe. There's another sapling. Let's go get this sapling. Yeah, Nifo is losing it. What Nifo should lose is the the guts. Whilst we're doing this. All right, we're going to do the usual go make a fire up there. We'll see maybe we will make a fire down here um we'll definitely drop the scent up here yeah just some non juicy cattails all right here is our destination and I don't think we can get a wind block here. All right, you can stay there. You can stay there. I'm going to drop you guys. And we're going to need a fire. So. Thing is where is a good spot is that like a little nook right there does it go in at all not really I can't feel my feet. even down here might be okay it all depends right like it all depends on where Where the wind is going to decide to go. I'm going to use a stick and a chunk of coal. Come on, little fire. All right. Uh, oh, we have 18. Let's use two chunks of coal. Hey, we got fire starting four. Looky, looky. All right, let's go. Um, let's just do 0.5. And we'll do that again. I don't want to get too, too much water because we will get some inside the bunker. But I also don't really have anything to do here. Uh, we have six of those. You're at 90. Well, let's give her. It's dusk, so I can't be far behind. I hear the music. Not time yet. Uh, how much water did we have now? 293. Uh, let's do that. Let's make some coffee actually while we have a fire. Not time yet. Uh, let's make more coffee. Not quite. Not quite. Uh, 
I think we're just going to go in and go to bed. So I'm not going to be... Uh, is one of these hot? Let's drink you. Just to get a temperature buff. Yeah, the blue one on the radio. The blue, blue is for bunker. But it's still not working. Let's just have a sip of our water. I think if we just walk over there, it should be... Should kick in. I don't know. Maybe I go boil another 0.5 in each pot. This is where you wish you had something to do, right? Ninety. There we go. There we go. Pick up all of our stuff. We are going to go in here. What we're gonna do is hopefully there we go we're gonna I think we'll end this here and we'll pick this up when we start tomorrow so for those of you on YouTube if you like what you saw please like and subscribe and I will see you all tomorrow